The International Election Observers from Organization for Security and Cooperation in Europe, Office for Democratic Institutions and Human Rights, reviewed the presidential runoff in Mongolia was efficiently administered despite of illegal uncertainty. For the second round, the OSCE of the IHR and limited election observation mission included 11 experts in the capital and 19 long-term observers deployed throughout the country. The observers were drawn from 23 OSCE participating states. On July 8, Ambassador Gert Henrik Arens, the head of the OFDIHR mission, held a press conference on the second round of Mongolia's presidential election and said, Our mission will remain in Mongolia throughout the conclusion of the electoral process, and the final report issued in about eight weeks from now will include recommendations on how the process can be improved.